Hey, uh, happy Sunday everyone. Uh, church was great. Uh, now we get to come home and make it a nice Zaretta sauce. You know, my grandma will you say. Uh, right here we get the pan going with the sautéed uh, onions and uh, I didn't mean to shake that up. Uh, trying to shake the pan. Uh, so over here we start cooking the sauce. We sauté onions and garlic. Get that going. Get the pan hot. And the olive oil. Um, we proceed to put it in there then. Then we throw in all our spices. Uh, all your other spices. It's kind of up to you what you want to put in. Uh, you know, I take a little handful of this, a handful of that. Kind of learned from my mom, my dad, both very good cooks in southern Italy. And uh, so there you have it. Well, we'll show you back in a little bit what it looks like. And right now I'm going to cut up, chop up some garlic over here and get that in the pan. For your viewing pleasure, next cucina. We'll, uh, over an hour for now, we'll talk to you in a bit. Oh, you don't want to see all that stuff. Okay, Nick back here with uh, Nick's Cucina. Uh, going to teach you a little bit about what I know about cutting up garlic. So I already kind of peeled the back off. You kind of smash, smash the garlic down with the back of your knife. Uh, that kind of, kind of gets that shell off of it. Uh, you know, you cut off both ends. Uh, chop, chop. Cut off both ends. Now I'm going to take it and chop this up and get it in this pan. To finish sautéing, I'll get uh, three, four pieces in there, and a bunch more onions. Onions cook faster, I think, than the garlic. You don't want to burn the garlic. Tastes a little good roasted, but not burnt, so you don't want to burn it. Keep your flame down, kind of low, and go. Low and go. Okay, back to you in a minute. Okay, so we uh, dice up the cloves of garlic. Take them on my knife, and I... Get them in the pan. Get them going. And get another one done. That's what we do. Three or four big cloves should be enough. Unless you really like some hot garlic. Again, peel this back a little bit. Kind of hard to do with one hand because I don't have a tripod for this camera. Uh, so we're going to take the knife and chop off the ends. It's a little easier. A little bit easier. Very hard to do with one hand. So I'm going to put you down for a second. Okay, if you have a, a sharp knife, you can kind of shave the garlic off if you want, or like I like to do is kind of dice it up. Uh, these are shavings. This is a pretty sharp knife. I can do it with two hands here, but not, like I said again, not with one. So got that sauteing, got that bubbling. Got to turn that down. Your, your heat's always got to be in a good spot. You really don't want stuff boiling. You want it to, you want it to simmer, and cook and cook down these tomatoes. I put all types of tomatoes in. I used uh, today. We used some puree. I like to make a lot of sauce, so we use one big can of sauce. I use one big can of puree, and these are like 28 ounce cans. Then I've used a couple peeled tomatoes, and then we're going to use a, a paste. Okay, Nick here. I'm back with the uh, Nick's American Italian Cucina. Yeah, I like to think I have a TV show, but I really don't. It's my own for my own pleasure and fun here at home. My wife's going out to eat, so I get to cook. I'm going to throw a little bit of that in the pot before uh, summer or before getting it uh, sautéed, just a little. This pan 